Hello, I'm Dr. David Green, CEO of the Nevada Pain Network, where we bring you anything and everything educational for pain management. Today the topic is, how exactly does an epidural steroid injection work? Well, for over 60 years now, pain doctors and orthopedic doctors have been utilizing epidural steroid injections to give tremendous pain relief to those suffering from a pinched nerve. And that is often sciatica, where, here's an example. There's a spine model from the side looking in. This is from the back. These yellow things are nerve roots as they come out from the spine. At this level, the model shows a herniated disc, which is a piece of disc that has squeezed out and is pinching this nerve root, okay? And that's called a herniated disc, and it's pinching, and that causes sciatica with pain that shoots down the leg. It's very, very painful, okay? So an epidural steroid injection can put soothing steroid medicine around this area and bathe that nerve root. So here's what happens when you have a pinched nerve. Pretend my finger's the nerve and my fist is the disc pushing. That in and of itself is not painful, okay? It may cause some weakness, it may cause some numbness, but not pain. What causes the pain is the inflammation that sparks up. And you can sometimes see that in surgery where your nerve root looks all red and angry, okay? But when the steroid medication is injected in the epidural space and it bathes this area, it can decrease pain, okay? And that may take a series of three injections to get optimal pain relief, but it typically works. Now what it doesn't do is it doesn't fix the problem. It doesn't take this disc herniation and make it go away. It doesn't dissolve it, all right? The theory is that you put the, and the reality is that you put the steroid in, it bathes this area, soothes it, and then it lets the body disintegrate this piece of disc that knows it's not supposed to be there, okay? It just takes a while to disintegrate it, all right? Now, if you have surgery, you get rid of that disc herniation faster, but if you can avoid surgery with the steroid injections and letting the body do it itself, you take away, you know, the risk of, of the surgery, okay? That's how epidural steroid injections work. They don't fix the problem, they just put a big band-aid over it while the body takes care of it. There are three different types of epidural steroid injections now. One goes, puts the medicine right in this area where the nerve root comes out, and that's called a transforaminal epidural injection. Another one puts the medicine back in here, between these two levels, I'm sorry, back right here, and that's called an interlaminar epidural injection, okay? And both those work really well, 75 to 90 percent of the time. And the third one actually goes real low, lumbar sacrum sacral hiatus. And that's called a caudal, C-A-U-D-A-L, epidural steroid injection. And that also works very well. And the medicine kind of comes up, migrates north. Pain doctors put more medicine in for that injection. And it can actually cover multiple levels. So if you have spinal stenosis, multiple nerve roots being pinched, that works very well for that. Okay? That's how an epidural injection works. There's plenty more information on our website at painmanagementlasvegas.com. Visit us on the web today. In Las Vegas and Henderson, we work with Innovative Pain Care, which is the best pain management clinics in the Las Vegas area. They have double board certified pain doctors who are award-winning and skilled in over 25 different treatments. Medications, interventional treatments, all the latest modern cutting edge treatments that can give you 12 to 24 months or longer of pain relief, help you avoid surgery, get back to working, playing with your kids. Most major insurances are accepted along with self-pay, workers compensation, personal injury liens. There's a whole list on the website and the phone number is on the screen. I'm Dr. David Green with the Nevada Pain Network. Your pain stops here.